Hi everybody, Ashley and Jerome here from <coughs> Atmosphere Collectibles and we have a big unboxing of new releases to show. Um, so we think this might, it could be a long video so we're going to go ahead and get started right now. Yeah. Uh, so first off, I've got uh, my third man, which is an exciting one. I think this whole box is the reissue of the 20th anniversary reissue of uh the white stripes white blood cells and this is a limited edition peppermint pinwheel colored vinyl so the mock I'm, I'm going to probably open one of these even though i already have this album i'm probably going to open one of these and uh you know and keep it just because uh the mock-up color color uh variant looks really really awesome so Anyway, we've got quite a bit. Now so, some of those are taken. Yeah, I did have some pre-orders for these. Um, and so we probably will have, uh, but we'll have plenty for the shop. So I know a lot of places are sold out of that. But um, if you need a copy, just reach out and uh, maybe we can help. So this is a black album. It's the box set. It's got a die cut box. It's really nice. Um, Oh, I didn't realize I got another one of these. Oh, yeah. So, oh, I didn't even, I hadn't even seen this. So, yeah, um, if anybody was wanting the, the black, the big box set of Metallica's Black Album, reach out. I don't, although I don't have them all here, I can get a few more. So, uh, yeah, we have, that's a nice set. That's big. That's a very nice set. Uh, cool. Uh, King sets. Crimson Discipline. Is it? Yeah, that had been out of stock for a while. I guess that's why I had ordered it. It's not like a new release or anything, but... We really don't know what's in these boxes. Before. <laughs> well, we've been placing so many orders, uh, and we have a lot going on, so... Sorry, I don't remember everything. Uh, now, this is the Echo and the Bunny Man Ocean Rain. This is one of the Rocktober releases. Um, I ran out last week and yes, I know I have a few, yeah. yeah, I have a few pre-orders for these. So, uh, I might the you know, if you pre-ordered this with me and haven't been in to pick it up, I do have a, you know, they are here. So yeah. Alice Cooper, music on vinyl trash. And that one is a special order. That one's claimed. Uh, I do. I know. And I have one more person who's looking for it. So hopefully I can get another one and then that one will be for them. Uh, so we've got Opeth and Cotta Vin Vinium, and I'm probably butchering the title. Uh, we had uh, Opeth uh, record last week. Uh, that one sold. Uh, this is a special order. Uh, let me know if you need one, and I'll get you on the list. Uh, SG Goodman, Old Time Filling. Yeah, she's really good. Uh, I want to say that she's opening up for Jason Isbell on some of his shows. And uh, she's from Kentucky, which is like close by. Um, Health Disco Two. Uh, this is Get Color Remixed. Uh, we have we really like Health. And I don't know I, if we have Disco Two. We have I don't know all if, of them, but that one I think. Oh well, I'm sure he might want to open this up, but he's kept a big one this week. So I mean, those are all remixes. So okay. Uh, Isis, and this is. Uh, uh, Panopticon. Panopticon. <laughs> I'm yes. probably mispronouncing that. that too. Uh, it's a great uh, band, though. Yeah, and that one was a specially request. Oh, uh, we've got Kelly Clarkson wrapped in red. So it's Kelly Clarkson Christmas album. I believe this may be a special order, but I can't. If I don't have more than one in here, I can get more. So. All right. So Kanye West, my beautiful dark twisted fantasy, back in stock. Yeah, that one had been out of stock for a while, so, oh, of course. I keep going. Okay. Misfits, Legacy of Brutality, back in stock. We still got a few minutes, so we're going to try to knock this video out. Uh, so, yeah, we have, now, last week was the release date, and I do have someone that's been waiting for this. I'm sorry for the delay. They sent me the wrong color. But I do finally have the Halloween Kills motion picture soundtrack. This is the orange vinyl edition. So last week we got the wrong color variant, um, but now that I have the orange, um, everyone will be happy. I what a time to be alive, Drake and Future. 
Um, we've got, what do we have here? Um, Ancients, Heart of Oak. Uh, this is gray double vinyl, limited to 300 worldwide. I believe this is a special order, but I do have more that I can get. So, um, definitely a cool one. Now, this is Alanis Morissette, Jagged Little Pill Acoustic, and this is music on vinyl. And that is also, I have someone who's been waiting for that. So unless they found it in the meantime, this had been out of stock. So uh, this is awesome. We've got Slayer Live Undead. This has got the original artwork uh, and it has uh, the lyric and photo insert with a large poster. And it's a blue and black split vinyl limited to 2,250 copies. So yeah, Slayer. As far as that record goes, there's actually three different versions as far as track list. So, I believe this is close to the original version. And it's got... Some of them combined, um, combined the EP with that and make us... Well, this shows seven tracks, so I don't know how, how many is on the original. Yeah, it's either six or seven. So, yeah, uh, there you go. But they did a, a picture disc, uh, a different picture disc. That was always a picture disc. But they did a different picture disc. Uh, a while back ago, it was silver. There was even yet another track list. Uh, this is Pearl Jam No Code. Back in stock. Um, this is also a special order. It's Oasis, the Master Plan. Um, this had been out of stock for a while, and I had a one of my regulars ask for it, and then luckily it only took like a few weeks to pop up. So happy for that. A fantastic woman. Original motion picture soundtrack. And that's uh, the uh, music on vinyl at the movie series. Ooh, here we go. Well, one, it's funny because the hype sticker is sideways, but it's UFO 2 flying one hour space rock. And it's 180 gram remaster for vinyl is what the hype says. But we love UFO um, and uh, definitely one of our favorites. Yeah. yeah. But anyway, uh, so yeah, happy to have this in. I'm sure it'll it's sell really record. fast because we uh, talk about them all the time. So we'll play UFO all the time. I'll try to get more. This is Sugar Cold Start Static. That's a craft recordings, and I believe that might have been a special order. Uh, we've got Lucinda Williams, Funny How Time Slips Away, a night of 60s countries classics. So this is part of the uh, Lou's Jukebox series, and this is volume four. Uh, this is great. Yeah. Uh, this is Lady Gaga, the fame monster. Uh, Picture this. Yeah. Gotcha. Well, I back-ordered all of the, like, out-of-stock uh, Lady Gaga's recently. Speaking of Lucinda Williams. Uh, so we got Lucinda Williams, Bob's Back Pages, A Night of Bob Dylan Songs. And this is all her doing all Bob Dylan songs. And this is the Loose Jukebox Volume 3. There's a Tom Petty one. There's a, there's various ones. And there's I don't think they're shows. done yet. Like, yeah. I think there's going to be they, more. Well, I know like they're going to have a Christmas one in December. Yeah. So. There's at least, that would be what, seven? Uh, I don't know. Oh. I can't remember. The Devil Makes Three. Uh, 180 gram red vinyl. This has been out of stock for so long, guys. I flipped out when I saw it pop up. So, I... Uh, we also have some original presses and... Uh, yeah, we have some other going out. of the Devil Makes 3. Uh, Daughters. Um, this is not... Uh, this is called Canada Songs. This is like the metal Daughters, not Daughter Without the S, which is also a band that we love. But, um, so it's Daughters. Um... That's been out of stock for forever. Medvain, LD50. Yeah, this is uh, this is a high in demand record. Yeah. So this will not last. Yeah. The day I imagine. Literally had been out of stock for so long. Uh, so yeah, I was just like, yep, ship that one. Uh, another one that's been out of stock for a long time that everybody was asking me for. It came out and sold out like right off the bat, and it's Glass Animals Dreamland, and this is the indie exclusive blue colored vinyl i believe it's indie exclusive but it's blue vinyl and it's glass animals again sold out like it came out like a year ago sold out boom now i got them Yay. so this is uh christian kingfish ingram yeah that's his newest album i think it might have came technically came out last week or i could be wrong but we've got the translucent purple and uh kingfish was actually uh he was at the Henderson Handy yeah. WC Handy Blues Festival this year. So a lot of our locals got to see him. We missed it, unfortunately. 
This is another one. I was yeah, like, story of the goes. We got people waiting on that. Yeah. <laughs> we do. Because we only have like the record store day version out there. And I mean, that's not like cheap or anything, but it's cheaper than that, the that one. And it had been out of stock for forever. Uh, so I've got Bring Me the Horizon. That's the spirit. This also includes a CD. And this was a special order, but I can get more in. We also have some uh, older Bring Me the Horizon prints going out. We have, oh, I think they're all We have about three really good collections going out. What do you mean? All of those big, yeah, we claimed? showed them in the last video and they all got claimed. Oh. Uh, hmm. Samantha Fish, <laughs> faster. Alright, so we've got another copy of uh, Broken Hearts and Dirty Windows, Songs of John Prine. Um, this is also a special order. Volume 2 is coming out. Um, if you need a copy, you can pre-order with us. Uh, this one, and I'll try to get more of these too for the people who don't have it. Yet. All I know so far is sad list, Pink. This is the new one. Uh, it's live. And from what I understand, it's pretty good. Um, I had a special order for this one. It's Madonna Bedtime Stories. And um, this one's the one that's got Take a Bow on it. But uh, I can't get more in of these if uh, anybody's interested. Towards the Skull Throne, Enthroned, uh, this is their uh, classic record. Um, is that the one where there's two on there? Two albums? Or does it just have, like, two titles? Because it also says... Regis um, yeah. That's one that I, I haven't gotten in yet, because I kept thinking, oh, I saw Enthroned, yeah, and I was like, oh, I already got that. the EP and, and the album on here both, so, because uh, it is um, 18 tracks. Nice. So, That's a nice set. Yeah. A lot of music for your, but a lot of bang for the buck. Um, this is a new release. I might be a special order. Uh, Star Set Divisions. Um, not super familiar with this this group, but uh, I'm pretty sure that somebody asked me to get that one in. The War on Drugs. I don't live here anymore. That's the brand new War on Drugs. I think it doesn't come out until next week, but I did have one copy sent in. Uh, just. I was like, yay. <laughs> uh, Forrest Gump, the soundtrack, 32 American classics on two LPs. This is at the movies, uh, audio file vinyl. So I believe this is just a black vinyl. There's a lot of different pressings of this with different color variants. Uh, the only one that I can get in stock or that I can grab at the moment is just black vinyl. Uh, this one is was for a special it's order. It's a really cool soundtrack. Too. Yeah, it is. Uh, Pearl Jam Vitology, back in stock. So. Uh, so, one of my regulars, Doug, asked about this a, long, a while back ago on a video. He asked if we ever get in any Norma Tanga, or uh, if I'm pronouncing that right, I don't know. And it's called Walking My Cat Named Dog. Now, this is a reissue of the album. Um, it's uh, from 1966, and uh, this is the limited edition sky blue vinyl. Now, we did, like, so I do have an original, and I wanted to give Doug an opportunity to choose because uh, I, the original is, like, pretty, it's pricey. So I thought, well, this way I'll have, like, a not as pricey option in case he just wants, like, so I'll give him the opportunity to choose, and then I also have some for the bins. Coven, this is uh, Half a Century of Witchcraft. This is the uh, box set. Uh, it took me a long time to find original prints of all three of their records. Uh, this doesn't only have all three of their records. It also has uh, a couple bonus records that I'm unfamiliar with. So you've got the Classic 3, which includes uh, One Thin Soldier, and of course the, uh, the Black Mass... Uh, First record. And then uh, Esoterica. And then this is a comp called just under Rarities. Um, this this did not come sealed, so that's why we're able to open it yeah. up and show it. And then it's got this really nice book, um, you know, Half a Century with of Witchcraft. And then it's, you know, this really nice hardcover book. So this is a really nice set. We just only ordered one copy. Um, and uh, like I said, to get the originals is really expensive, and it'll take you a long time to find them all. Or at least, it, I guess, yeah, you know, with the internet, it doesn't take a long time to find them. <laughs> That's true, but that. whenever you know, he was hunting back, in, back the day, in the day, it took me a long time to get all three of them. Yeah, uh, so back in stock, I've got Christina Aguilera stripped. 
Um, if you need a copy of this, let me know because it's back in stock now. So right now it's back in stock. <laughs> All right, this is the studio album. It's 1998 to 2009. This is the uh, second box set. It's a Derek Green era, and it pretty much has angst and um, uh, everything up to 2009. All Alexi, uh, but yeah, let's see. Uh, Classic Five Records. Um, also, on Roarback, it does come with the Covers LP, which has them doing uh, Bullet to Blue Sky, U2. They also do Massive Attack, Devo, uh, Celtic Frost. Um, yeah, Drum Public Open Enemy, Up. Drum. Lots of covers. Uh, it's a great set. This, this era is really underrated. I really like it. But. Jerome opened up his copy and uh, he was playing it all day yesterday. So, uh, also another Rocktober release. Uh, we've got the heavy metal soundtrack, and this is on limited edition red vinyl. I had a lot of interest in this, a lot of pre-orders. I've got plenty of copies. I was the, I was like, I can't remember if they were going to come in on time, but they are here on time. So, heavy metal soundtrack is in. All right, Parquet Courts. Brand um, new. Yeah, this is uh, Sympathy for Life. Yeah. Still haven't heard that. And I, I want to say we have like a deluxe version and then like a standard version. Um, also have Bear Sonic Journals, the Allman Brothers Band, Fillmore East, February 1970. This is uh, one of the 10 bands, uh, One Cause Limited Edition Pink Vinyl. So. A Moment Apart, Odessa. That was a special order. I don't it know was. if I grabbed an extra uh, one. So we will be shipping not. that out, uh, you know, well, it won't be today, but probably tomorrow. Um, Lincoln Park Hybrid, Hybrid Theory. This had also been out of stock for a long time, at least from my distributors. So, yay. And this artillery, we've been waiting on this for a while. It should have been in last Friday. I think last Friday is when so, it came out. But uh, Jerome's excited. He kept asking me, where's that artillery album? Where's that artillery album? Yeah, blue with red splatter vinyl by inheritance. Uh, the Wood Brothers, Muse, or the Muse. Uh, this is their most recent, I think this is their most recent album. Uh, and I just wanted to get one for the bin, so. The uh, brand new. Pokey Lafarge and the Blossom of Their Shade. Yep, it's a brand new. We got the indie exclusive variant. Um, so, um, restock of Tyler the Creator. Black Owens, it's a monster's holiday back in stock. Yeah, I think I have one out there. Uh, this is one Jerome Jerome has in his collection as well. But I thought, man, we haven't had this in the bins for a while. So it's Macabre's most recent album, and it's called. Carnival of Killers, and this is limited edition to 1,100 on Carnival Killings pre-edition vinyl. Um, um, it's a good record, like uh, last year, came out last year, but yeah, about a year uh, sounds so like every but, Macabre record. They yeah. never really changed. Jerome really so likes Macabre, and really nice guys too in that band. They are, they, they're nice really band. nice. Um, Demon Knight. Uh, just stop. in time for Halloween, so yeah, it was it's got Grave Diggers, Sepultura, Ministry, Pantera. It was uh, out of stock for a while. Uh, I mean, it came out like about a month ago, and then it, you know it sold out or whatever. I was able to snack two more. I was super surprised. Um, and another copy of Pora, a collection of Italian horror sounds from the Cam Sugar Archive. Uh, this, I believe this one is, uh, spoken for, we had a copy in last week and it sold and I, I'll try to get more if you're interested. Uh, but we think it's super cool. You know, Ennio Morricone is on here and along with many others. Daft Tone, Super Soul Review, live. Yeah. And that's the Indie nice exclusive sets. variant. It's like three records and it has a booklet. So, uh, the last one that we had, uh, sold already. Uh, so I've got more Slayer and more of the Halloween Kills in here. The Kill, Midnight Boom. Yeah, I hadn't had that in for a while, so it's happy they get that. Yeah. Uh, oh, I didn't know I got more of those. Oh, yeah, so that one's claimed. Uh, so Hellstorm, Vicious. How did they send us the FYE exclusive green vinyl? It's not FYE. 
I literally got this from my normal distributor, so that's kind of cool, fun. Um, but yeah, so the I've got another copy of the uh, Home Alone Christmas. Uh, Rob Dyer has for that, so that one's clean. I do. I'll try to get more. Uh, we got a couple copies of the Love Actually soundtrack. It's another kind of holiday classic. One of my favorite movies. I kept a copy. This is on really pretty uh, candy cane vinyl. And then now this one is kind of a funny story because I have a customer. I'm I've got Freddie Gibbs pinata back ordered and uh, and then I guess I had also gotten this and it's a group called Volcano and the album is called Pinata and it was supposed to be taken off my order because like it was the wrong album. Um, but I guess they accidentally left one on here, but it does have a CD it's limited to 300 copies on transparent vinyl. I'm not familiar with the group volcano, but I will be checking it out since now I, I need to, uh, just be able to sell it. So uh, volcano is not the metal group, is it? Doesn't look metal. No. Looks um, indie or something, you know. <coughs> Elliot Smith, either or. Yeah, 30th anniversary, uh, kill rock stars or something. Uh, so we got Lord Pure Heroine. Uh, this is a uh, rest breathe back in stock. I don't think I had a copy out there, or maybe I do. Oh, I've also got some CDs for that were special orders, just to show that we are more than happy we to order CDs. CDs if anyone requests. So we've got the Dora Warlock Triumph in Agony Live. Uh, this includes a Blu-ray. Uh, it's in a nice digipack, double digipack here. Uh, we have... The Davy Knowles, What Happens Next, new CD. Uh, Joe bom Bominasa, uh, Time Clocks, the brand new studio album with a collectible 24 page lyric art booklet. Cool. Cigarettes After Sex, 7 inch. That's special oh. order. Is, they is... do a cover of, uh, was it Ario Speedwagon or something? Keep, Keep on, on loving, loving you. you. Yes. Um, hmm. yes. We've got Ice Nine Kills. Uh, brand new album, brand new CD, I mean, whatever. Uh, Judas Priest, Reflections. This is the uh, Judas new Judas Priest. And then, I don't know, Walter Bishop Jr., Fourth Cycle, Keeper of My Soul, uh, featuring Ronnie Laws on CD. I probably thought that was going to be a record, so I'll have to figure out that situation. Bad, bad, not good, talk memory. Ooh, this is look some at cool that packaging. packaging. Yeah, it looks like they uh, really outdid themselves. Yeah. All right. Oh, okay. <laughs> so brand new Paul McCartney. I do have a special uh, orders for this. So I'll have to figure out how many, I, like if I have any extra. They reissued the new album and this is the 3333 edition. One time pressing a indie exclusive splatter vinyl. And it is pressed by third man and the color variant looks super, super cool. So if you, I have to count out how many I've got versus how many copies uh, people requested. I will have extras. I just noticed how many copies I got. So please get with me soon if you ask me about this so I can make sure that I remember all of the people who had mentioned it. I mean, Cigarettes after sex. Also a special order. Unless hopefully I have to. Uh, Slayer, Hello Waits. This is the orange and black split vinyl edition. Very cool. And like I said, they're they're including posters with these uh, reissues. Uh, this is Palace. Palace Brothers. Is, uh, or is that? Well, I'm assuming. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Palace Brothers Palace. Uh, we've got more of the white stripes. Uh, got yes. a lot of white stripes. We did get uh, a, moment, an extra one? a moment apart, Odessa, yeah, for the store. I thought we would, because it's pretty cool. For the first time on vinyl, there it's music and songs from the film Metroland, and this is uh, featuring original compositions from Mark Knop Knopfler. So I figure, like, Dire Straits fans would be interested in that, or just, like, isn't that Mark Knopfler by Dire Straits? Uh, the best of Bauhaus Crackle. Um, widespread, pan widespread panic every day on colored vinyl. Uh, I got, I know I had one in like, last week. Uh, I got an extra copy for the bins. The 
in the I ground. Know, yeah, I know what Tim's saying. And you know what I'm saying? Ah, uh, there you go. <laughs> Danny Brown. That includes a really cool sticker wheel. It look or a record that's full of stickers. It was still some of the Yeah, it does. Yeah, twelve stickers. Yeah. Uh so last I had gotten some of these a few weeks ago and I was just like, I really, really want one. Um, and then I want one for the bins. So this is Portishead uh live in New York, uh musical and vinyl. I've got one for the bins and then if Drum lets us keep one, yeah, I mean, I know he fun. wants it, but we've been keep. He kept a Sepultura box set, so I get to keep one of those. The black keys, the big come up. That's the um, surprise color vinyl variant. I've seen it, and it's really pretty. Uh, widespread panic again. We've got Space Wrangler. Um, Gun Vile. Uh, yeah, that's Kurt Vile. And uh, it had been out of stock for a while, too, I think. I don't know. But people like her pile, so I was like, I'll get that. Uh, Gabby Bar Barrett, Goldmine. This is pressed on gold vinyl. This is a special order, but uh, the ladies who requested it have a really cool taste in music. She's got to be, like, country. But um, anyway, uh, so this one's a special order. It's recent album. Tell me how you, how you really feel, Courtney Barnett. Uh, yeah, I just was getting some Courtney Barnett in the bins. She's getting ready to put out a new album, and also a, a few customers have mentioned, or a customer had mentioned, like that they liked her. So, you know, uh, we've got Passengers, songs for the drunk and brokenhearted. Uh, all packaging is from 100% recycled materials, and um, I don't know if this was a special order or if I just decided to order it because of the cover. I don't know. I'm not familiar with Passenger. Uh, got another Lincoln Park hybrid. I'm still waiting on Meteora to be back in stock, but in the meantime, we got that. Um, surely we have more. Oh, well, we definitely have uh, another box set to show. I'll just go ahead and get it. We do have a lot of used. It's going to be priced up over the weekend, so maybe Monday we'll do a used video. So. Um, the box that you for. The Nick Cave. And we must have another box. Oh, we do have other Nick Caves. Uh, hmm. Because we have the Nick Caves that are... Oh, I found it. I found it. Okay, here's another box the drone can start going and showing. And then uh, I'll find that Nick Cave box set before I did with that. So this is uh, Set the Night on Fire, uh, Robbie Krieger, the uh, guitarist with the doors, Krieger, how do you say that? So. A View from the Top of the World, this is uh, Dream Theater, finally. I've got the, now this one was a special order because I told people if they wanted me to get this in, I mean, I, it, it was pricey, so I only, I didn't get an extra one for the bins, although I really wanted to. This is Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds, B-Sides and Rarities, parts one and two. So this is seven LPs, uh, exclusive sleeve notes by Sean O'Hagan. Um, really cool set. And, um, this one's our, uh, was a special order, so. You know, Lucas can come grab it. All right, these are the Atheist reissues, and unfortunately, we only have one of each of these. So we have Unquestionable Presence, uh, Elements. Okay, we have two. Yeah, we have two. Unquestionable. Of Did we not get the third one? Um, no, keep going. I mean, they might be packaged together in the box, but um, I'm gonna go with. Oh, they're probably in here somewhere. Okay. So we've got Fudge Tunnel, Hate Songs in E Minor. Fudge Tunnel drum is a band that Drone likes. <laughs> they do uh, Sunshine of Your Love on that one. It's pretty good. Oh. Uh, no Effects Ribbed. 
that's a re a special reissue, which uh, I might have a couple on there, but one of them definitely is a special order. Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds, B-Sides and Rarities. Now, this is part two. So, uh, it's a 2LP set. The box set has part one as well, but um, this is part two by, by itself. Hopefully, they'll do, well, I guess I'd be a lot of records, so. A uh, piece of time, the other atheists. Oh, the one has a pretty bad quality. Hmm. All right. So, uh, <laughs> those three albums are great. Uh, oh, more of the Duran Duran. The newest Duran Duran. Yeah. Uh, Future Past. So, I guess that comes out today. We had a copy in last week, which I guess today is the release Still date. Still, feels like Ordinary World, isn't it? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, future path. Uh, Slayer Haunting the Chapel. This is the red and white marbled vinyl. This is the classic EP on 45 RPM. Three tracks or four? Uh, it says four. Or no, classic. No, I don't know. Uh, more no effects ribbed. Um, another artillery. Artillery. <laughs> Uh, we've got another October release. This is the Give Me Danger soundtrack. It is, um, it's got four super rare LP tracks, limited edition, ultra clear vinyl. Uh, this soundtrack by Jim Jarmusch. The documentary, is, I think you can watch it on Hulu. It's, it's really good. Uh, we've seen it. And I mean, if you're a fan of the Stooges, I mean, this is just a great, great addition. Uh, to the uh, it's also got the Bowie mix of Gimme Danger, uh, Iggy and the Stooges. So now we also have one more thing to show. It is we don't always order books, um, but when we do, <laughs> no, uh, the this is Set the Night on Fire, and it's a uh, book by Robbie Krieger of The Doors, and uh, this is a nice hardcover book. And if you, we've got a few copies, they are autographed by Robbie Krieger. So, and if you buy the book from us, we'll have a link to like, um, I don't, it's like a interview or something special with Robbie Krieger. And, uh, so anyway, so it's like a audio. zoom thing. Yeah. But, uh, it's, it's free with purchase. So autograph book, um, living, dying and playing guitar with the doors is pretty cool. So I think that is for real this time, the end. Um, I will have to also reiterate that we have bought another collection and I don't know how soon it'll be before we get a used video up, but it'll be worth the wait is all I can say because it's awesome. Uh, so Jerome, we uh, push the button. <laughs> I need a little clicker, but anyway, we want to thank you for watching our videos and we hope you have a great weekend. Thank you.